happen, but it's all about rhythm and balance. It's all about rhythm and balance, and it's all about ability as well as they walk into line for our feature race, this Clarence House chase, and it looks like a real heavyweight clash. Here's Simon. So Paul Townend leading them in on under so from Deffy de Soy and Barry Geraghty and Maracuja at the back. And they're off. Here it is then, the Tingle Creek rematch between Under So and Deffy de Soy, who are first and second as they head towards the first fence in this matchbook Clarence House chase. Under So up first from Deffy de Soy. Then Janica in the green jacket on the inside of the white blaze Capeland and held up his Maracuja last of the five. So Under So in front resuming his uh, front running role he's often made the running in the past he's tanking along in the hands of paul town in the 12 year old tracked through by his big rival Deffy de soy and barry garrity in second place janica third capeland and maracuja as they jump their second fence and they all jump that one pretty well particularly the front pair under so from Deffy de soy the winners of 16 grade ones between them, these two horses. Under so, three times a winner of this race in the past, draws to the next and puts in a lovely leap there. So too Deffy de Soy, who draws to within a length on landing. Janica is back in third, then Capeland, and finally Maracuja. So Under so leads the way, passing the judge with a circuit to go in this grade one prize, leading by a length and a half to Deffy de Soy. Janica on the inside of Capeland and finally Maracuja as they swing right-handed now and head towards a line of four fences on the run down to Swinley Bottom. The third of these is an open ditch and under so out in front from Deffy de Soy. Capeland moving up a bit on the outside. Janica towards the rail and Maracuja all safely over and on now towards the next. This is fence number five of the 13 they have to jump under so racing powerfully in the lead put himself right Deffy de soy almost alongside on landing janica close up wide is capeland and then maracuja on now to this open ditch continuing the descent to swinley bottom under so by about three quarters of a length to Deffy de Soy going into this one. Deffy de Soy jumping up well for Barry Geraghty in the green and yellow hoops on the outside. Janica still travels well too on the rail as they draw towards the next plane fence before they run into the right hand turn on a great stride there under so and came up in magnificent style for Paul Townend. Emerged with a two length lead over Deffy de Soy. Then Janica, Capeland, and Maracuja. So under so beginning to turn the screw now as they turn right-handed out of Swinley Bottom. They've got six fences left to jump. The pace is lifting. Under so by two lengths or so to Deffy de Soy. Janica in third, Capeland, and Maracuja. On towards the next. This is six out. Under so over. A little bit awkward from Deffy de Soy. On now towards five out. Deffy de Soy within a length of under so. Janica on the inside. A good jump from under so this time from Deffy de Soy. Now they're racing towards the final open ditch. This is the fourth last. And under so just drawing slightly further ahead going into this one. And Barry Geraghty was asking Deffy de Soy there for a good jump. He received a pretty good jump. Uh, on the inside, Janica is well in touch as they now jump the third last. Under so attacking it from Deffy de Soy. Then Janica followed back in the field by Maracuja and Capelin. So they turn now towards the home turn with three furlongs left to cover. It's uh, under so tracked through by Deffy de Soy. This is it. This is the rematch. It's under so by a length and a half. Deffy de Soy coming there on the outside. They've kicked away from Maracuja and Janica. Over two out. Under so joined by Deffy de Soy, who put in the better jump. Oh, and he powers away. Deffy de Soy comes clear in the blink of an eye from under so. Maracuja third. And then Janica. And now at the final fence, Deffy de Soy. Brilliant over the last two superb jumps over the last two in the Clarence House. And Deffy de Soy comes. Coming home, an easy winner today, easily beating under, so who's rallying? But it's Deffy de Soy who wins another grade one, the seventh of his career. Under so closing 
in the uh, last hundred yards, but uh, easily beaten. Maracuja third, and Janica in fourth. There are some occasions in horse racing, Jim, when only the word wow will do, and I think that's one of them.